Do you believe in monsters? Or the thing that lives under your bed? Do you believe nightmares are real? Are you afraid? What's up everyone, it's the Razored Edge, and today we're here to discuss whether or not we think the Locust have returned from the dead to continue to be the threat in Gears of War 4's storyline. Gears of War fans love the Locust, they're a huge reason Gears is so unique, but right away I'm going to say no, I don't think this threat are the Locust at all. The Pouncer creature has some similar traits and does look quite like a Locust in some aspects, but I think that's where the relation ends. The Locust in the original Gears of War were presented to us as these creatures in the night that came out of the dark to snatch children from their beds as they slept. As the Gears of War series went on, we became desensitized to their scary factor. We saw them in broad daylight and nothing about them was very intimidating or a surprise anymore. The Locusts were still a fun enemy to fight against and a staple to the Gears of War franchise, but if the Coalition want to bring that horror aspect the first Gears of War game was going for, I feel like they have to introduce a new threat that we know very little about. They would be shrouded in mystery which would only make for a more exciting and intense campaign, which is what we all want. But here's the thing, I think I think these creatures will be similar in a lot of ways to the Locust, because that's what Gears of War fans love, to fight these monsters from the unknown, but this time it will have that aspect of mystery again. Ever since the Gears of War 4 E3 stage demo in June of 2015, I've heard Rod Ferguson mention on a few occasions that we kind of know everything there is to know about the Locust. Here's an extract from an interview that Rod did with USA Today that backs up the idea of the Locust being finished in the Gears of War universe. As we went from Gears 1 through 3, what you hear from the fans is people hearkening back to what Gears 1 provided them. You didn't know the Locusts, you didn't know these characters, and you didn't know the world. There was this mystery and tension, the idea of being afraid of things that go bump in the night, or the monster that lives under your bed. As you progress through Gears 1, 2, and 3, it becomes less about that, less about the nightmare in the dark, and it becomes almost more of a military game where I know what the Locust units are, and they basically become a World War II enemy, and I know how to to kill them. It becomes more about executing a battle plan than, oh my god, I wonder what's around the corner. What we hear is people want to go back to that feeling that they had when they first played Gears 1, that sense of mystery, that sense of wonder, that sense of drama and tension. To sum it up, I truly believe Adam Phoenix's machine worked and that the locusts are dead and gone, but these new creatures, whatever they may be, have the potential to be just as, if not more amazing and iconic than the locusts ever were, and I can't wait to see it. But what do you guys think? Would you be upset if these creatures aren't Locust. Are you happy as long as they're similar in some way? Let me know in the comments down below. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe to my channel for more Gears of War 4 related content, share the video around if you really enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. Peace.